All right, so we're turning to this search bar with race and ethnicity, which is going to be soon updated to be race, ethnicity, and nationality. Um, religion, disability, which is getting updated to be disability and illness, grade level, immigrant status, and noun. So just walking through all of these, um, starting with Harry, um, we know that he is white, Caucasian, and we also know that he's British. Um, religion, we don't know what Harry's religion is, and it's also not pertinent, so we're just gonna move on from that one. Disability, he doesn't have any, but this would be, for example, if Harry had cystic fibrosis, or he was blind, or in a wheelchair. These are all things that are important and relevant to his character, so we would tag them here. Grade level, we know that Harry is first year at Hogwarts, but um, we don't know his grade level in more common terms. But for example, if you knew that a character was in second grade, you would add a second grade tag here. If it's a kindergartner, add kindergarten. And the grade levels exist up through 12th grade. Immigrant status, Harry's not an immigrant, but if a character is either a first generation immigrant or a second generation immigrant, um, if you would please tag that. And then the last thing is noun. So noun is for things like, um, here's a wizard, that's, an essential part of his character, so we want to add that. This is like occupations, farmer, construction worker, doctor. Um, it can also be used for familial role. For example, if a character is a mom, and that's an essential part of her identity, then we want to add mom here. So mom, dad, grandma, grandpa. Um, but again, only things that are really relevant to the character. For example, Harry is someone's nephew, but that's not an essential part of his role. So we're not gonna tag him with nephew. He is a son, but again, not an essential part of his role in this story. Um, he's an orphan, which is kind of an essential part of the story. So we're gonna add that. The other thing you could use this for is animal type. If this is an animal character, for example, if this is a lion, we wanna, Harry was a lion, or if we were doing tagging the Cowardly Lion in The Wizard of Oz. We would add lion here. And on all these tags, you wanna use the most specific form available to you. So if we're tagging the Cowardly Lion, we wanna tag lion, but not also tag big cats and safari animals and animals. We just need lion. And if the tag you're looking for isn't in the system, you can create it. Um, we ask that you only create it if you can think of several other good books that would also have the same tag. Because every time you create a tag, it creates a list, which is awesome, but we don't want to have a bunch of lists with just one book on them. So if you can think of several other books that you would rate 4.5 or higher, go ahead and add the tag to the system. Otherwise, use the next highest level of the tag. So rather than adding a really specific type of chipmunk, just add chipmunk. That's kind of an example, but hopefully you get where I'm going with that. Um, the other thing is, we talked about this a little bit, but you only want to add nouns that are part of the character's essential role. So mm -hmm. if you've read Jabari Jumps, it's about um, a little black boy who is facing his fear of the high dive. And he happens to be at a swimming pool, he just passed a swimming test, but we wouldn't tag him so we would tag him with, let's say Jabari here, major, because he's the main character, he's a child, he's male, he's black. We don't know about his religion, disability, grade level, immigrant status. But even though he's swimming in the book, we don't want to tag the book. We don't want to tag Jabari with the noun swimmer. Because he happens to be swimming, but there could very easily be another book about Jabari where he was at a playground or he was going to school. Um, but for a picture book biography of Michael Phelps, we would tag Michael Phelps with swimmer because it's an essential part of his identity. So there's that search box.